Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is the Disney Darling, also known as Nikki. <laughs> uh, today I thought I would bring you some magic mail as well as some pen trades. Um, I kind of want to bring some joy on here for uh, people that are kind of missing Disney as much as I am right now. Um, kind of when I'm sitting in the house, I thought it would be nice to send some encouragement your way as well as to share some uh, pens that I have received recently. Um, so, um, yeah, I have said before that pen trading can get addicting and that is so, 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 so true. Um, so I have a limit on myself where I am kind of trying to find some deals with pens. I try not to spend too much on pens and a lot of what I do, um, I trade for. So a lot of the pens you see today, um, I did not buy with my own money. A lot of them are traded, um, or gifts to me, um, the one collection that I do um, make sure that I get every month is the uh, Minnie Mouse, uh, the main attraction collection. And just a little heads up, ladies and gentlemen, that comes out this weekend, Saturday to be exact. Um, I believe it is 7 a.m. if you are in the California side of the world. And I believe it is 10 a.m. if you are on um, the West Coast side of the world, kind of where I am. That is where I am. So it comes out at 10 a.m. So that is just an extra special little treat um, for us folks that are missing Disney. So again, without further ado, we are going to start our Magic Mail Pin video. So, the first package is coming from a lady named Terry. She is um, an eBay seller. She's fantastic, folks. She got I got two pins from her that are of the rescuers. I got Bernard. He... Um, if you can see him, I'm sorry my lighting's not the best. This is sweet little Bernard. And let me let you know, The Rescuers is just such a great, um, underrated, classic Disney movie, and it is fantastic. While you're sitting in the house kind of stuck around, I would give that one a rewatch. Um, it was one of my favorites growing up, and it just is fantastic. So along with Bernard, I got sweet little Miss Bianca. Um, so as you can see, they are a pair. Um, and I just, I love them together. Um, and I am so excited to have this as an addition on my pin board. Next up, we have, um, a trade that I made with a lady named Victoria. Um, and I am part of the Disney Kitty pin trading group. And sweet Victoria sent me this hand uh, drawn note that she wrote for me that said hope. And she says, thank you so much, Nikki, for trading with me. I hope you have a great day. Heart Victoria, and it's got sweet little Mickey Mouse in the corner. And I just wanted you to say that it is so sweet when someone thinks enough to write a card um, when they trade with you. So that kind of brightened my day up. I was not expecting that, uh, but this is the pen that I was expecting. I traded her, this sweet little orange bird, a monogram. <laughs> Girl, I'm sorry, you guys. Orange Bird Monorail Pen. Again, as you can see, I am human and I do not edit these videos um, too much. <laughs> but this is the Orange Bird Monorail Pen. This is an amazing pen. Um, I was trying to start a collection of Orange Bird. In my opinion, he's a little harder to get a hold of because he is kind of like a in park. Um, Pen. So it's like it's a little harder to get a hold of if you're not going to Disney a lot. So I was so thankful um, that I was able to trade with her. Another trade that I made in the Disney uh, Kitty Pin Trading Group is I got the three um, girl bears from the Country Bear Jamboree. This to me is one of the most, the most underrated attractions in Magic Kingdom. This was an opening day attraction that Walt Disney uh, created himself. So I just love going in there and looking at it. But this is the three girls with the hidden Mickey. Um, I believe this was a probably a set. I do not know what year it came out. But I will tell you, I am so excited to be able to add this to my pin board. Um, I just love, 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 love that attraction. I think it's got hilarious adult humor in it. I think it's got wonderful music. You know, I'm a Southern girl again, true and true. So um, that might be why I like it a little much more than other people. But I, um, I really, really do love that attraction. So I'm so, so, so thankful to be able to add that to my pin board. Another package I got is in this cute little blue mailer this wonderful lady taylor traded with me and and the thing that just brightened my day up completely was she added a magic kingdom park map and i just think that is so so sweet of her to do 
Um, you know, right, right about now, we're not really getting to go to Disney, so it's so nice just to be able to pick this map up and kind of look at your favorite attractions. So I really am thankful that she did that. Um, she also included a sweet little post-it that says, thank you for trading with me, Taylor. And you know, it doesn't take much to, you know, bring a smile to my face, and that did. That brought a little smile to my face. So just adding that kind of stuff, again, in your trading um, mailers is just such a good way to brighten someone's day without even having to know somebody. Um, but with her, I traded um, for this Bing Bong pin. I think I have said in previous videos, I love Bing, Bing Bong, and this is now my first real merchandise item with him. I do have a button... Um, with Bing Bong, but now I have an actual pin of Bing Bong. I believe this came in an inside out set um, of all the other emotions from the movie. So I traded for her, I traded with her this pin, as well as this pin of Cinderella. I think you can probably um, still get this um, now. Um, this is part of the animators collection. And I think I said again in another video, I am loving my girl Cindy right about now. And I think this is such a cute darling pen. It is um, very, 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 very sweet. And she is very good looking in this picture. Very good detail and I really, really love it. Moving right along folks, I am now going to my next mailer. And this is from a sweet girl named Molly. And sweet Molly added a thank you card. And she added the pins right here. So I don't even have to take them off and show you. But I traded for, for these two pins. I am starting to get a Wally main collection. There is Eve and Wally. I traded for both of these. They are so sweet. You have cute little Wally right here and his girl Eve. And it's just such, um, they're cute pins and I'm, I'm so thankful to have them. Um, I think Wally is going to be part of my main collection at this point. Um, Wally is another one of those movies that I have gotten super obsessed with um, over the past few weeks. Um, that was my husband's favorite movie um, as a kid, I guess, um, favorite Pixar movie. For the longest time, I I didn't get why people liked Wally, um, but I think that's because I watched it for the first time when I was 12. And you know, a 12 year old kid um, doesn't really understand um, the quality of Wally and just being a, an adult now. Um, I just, uh, I love the movie. Um, there's so many lessons we can take from that. Even um, forever we can take lessons from that. And I just, I adore it. Um, so Wally is going to be one of my main collections now. I also have another pin uh, to show you guys. Um, this was from the Walt Life Pin subscription monthly. I decided to give them a little go. And this is the pin I received in my box this month. It is the 2020 um, Russell holding uh, the balloons and he is on the tree of life. This is from Walt Disney World. I believe the way they are doing this because I have not yet been to the parks in 2020. I believe that they are doing um, all four parks and they have different characters that would kind of be involved in those parks. Um, near the 2020 sign and I really I love that pen um, I think Walt Life did really well on that pen um, it was a good selection it was a good choice um, for my first box I was impressed I'm not sure if I will continue the service or not um, but I did I was impressed I did like it um, so if you are kind of interested in getting involved um, in pens or trading pens um, you might want to check out Walt Life subscription boxes they have a pen section and that is a good place to kind of collect some starter pens. Um, so th I, this is not a paid subscription. This is not um, a paid ad for you for them. Um, I just wanted to let you know that that is a good option to pick um, if you were trying to start a pen collection. The last thing that I am going to show you guys today is actually a surprise gift from one of my best friends in the world. Um, she is named Mariah. She is my college roommate. Um, we actually had an apartment together with um, myself and four other girls, five girls in one apartment, guys. Everybody thought we were crazy. I will say there was a few times we wanted to murder each other. We didn't though, <laughs> but it was rough. Um, but we um, are the best of friends. We have been best friends since college, freshman year. And I got a package from her 
and I am so excited to see what it is. Um, I have not yet opened it, but I am so, so excited to kind of, to see what's inside. Oh my goodness, guys. This is amazing. Um, this is a Figment Epcot pen, and it is a first release. First release. I have never, ever, ever been able to get a hold of this or see this in real life. This is amazing. I also told her a really long time ago that I wanted to start a Figment collection, and I guess she was paying attention to me because she sent me a Figment pen in the mail. I just, I cannot even. Um, so Mariah, if you were watching this, I love you, girl. Um, uh, you were so thoughtful. You were so sweet. Thank you so much for thinking of me. Um, this is such a cute pen. Um, listen, guys, the um, lighting in this room is not doing this pen justice because in the blue part, it is so sparkly. It is just amazing. And in the um, orange part here, it says, let your imagination soar. And I am so excited to add this to my collection. Um, I am trying to start a figment collection as well. Um, I am obsessed with figment. Um, I think he might be one of my favorite parts of Epcot. Just the fact that you know, he is so big on the imagination. He's so cute. He's purple. It's just, I don't know. There's something about him that I love. Well, folks, this is the end of the pen mail, the magic mail. Um, I hope that you got some encouragement, some Disney love out of this video. Thank you so much for tuning in, folks. If Let me know your favorite pen. Um, if you want to write that in the comments, tell me which pen's your favorite. Guys, I hope you're having a wonderful day. I hope um, you're staying safe. You're washing your hands. I love you all. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. Bye, my darlings. See you next time.